Hey, this is Chris Craddock with Redux Realty, and today I'm coming to you with a couple thoughts on renting versus buying. Hey, this is Chris Craddock with Redux Realty today talking about the difference between renting and buying. So a lot of people will rent because they see the price of a rental monthly payment as being lower than the price of a monthly payment for a mortgage. Well, some of that is smoke and mirrors when you realize that the average homeowner saves between five and $700 a month through uh, tax savings when you own a property. You realize that even though you may be paying more monthly, the savings and taxes actually makes it less than what you pay for rental and then you own it. The second thing is this. Every month when you're making a payment, you're either making a payment to pay off your landlord's house or you're paying off your own house. So your monthly principal brings the amount you go down, which brings your net worth up. And I always joke, you're either paying off your own house or you're paying off your landlord's house. So that's really, really important. And then third, I mean, we've all played Monopoly. We know that you win by buying real estate. That is the key, you know, buy real estate. And you live there for 20, 30 years, you have a house paid off that you're living in. So it's really important to think about where you're spending your money. Are you putting that investment into your own future or your landlord's future. So with that said, if you have any questions about renting versus buying, please let us know. And then the last piece here too is a lot of times people think you need a huge down payment to buy. Well, there's a lot of programs out there for first time home buyers that we could really get you set up in so that you can see that it is really easy to get into a house the first time. So give us a call, click on the link below, and we would love to chat with you. Until then, make it an amazing day.